You've heard some of the crazy trends and DIY cures out there that people are trying, but these take them to the next level. We're gonna go determine or help you determine, is it hope or hype? Celebrity makeup artist Huda Katan recently discussed how vaginal anti-itch cream can be used as an alternative to makeup primer. So she thought it helped dry her cheeks out. Um, you know, so, one of the so ingredients is... The primer meaning to, to clean your skin. Well, to help... You Not know, as a base. Before you put makeup on, you can use a primer to kind of smooth the makeup and things like that. But I don't know that I would want to put this on my face. Um, Active it ingredients. It's a vaginal cream. <laughs> that could have something to do with it. Uh, okay. Well, but but, but the, the, there are elements of this that I could understand. If it's good for the vagina, I mean, it's probably... <laughs> I mean, that's sensitive tissue in there. That's mucosal, non-keratinized -keratin skin. That is true. So if it's good down there, that's probably not gonna hurt your face. And a good primer is really hard to find. It can break you out and stuff, but there are options, and this is not one of them. <laughs> okay. So don't put this on your face. You can get some type of bad allergy. It can be comedogenic, so it can block your pores. Because it is mineral oil based. Yes. I think that's a bad idea right there. Yeah, and you get acne and break out. I think he's, I've just, he's I've always been curious. Yeah, I wouldn't put this on your face. So, uh, vaginal anti-itch cream as a makeup primer, I'm gonna go with the verdict of hype, not hope. I think we... To each their own, certainly. I agree.